I'm Coach Trisha. I'm one of the coaches that is uh, putting this uh, Total Body Meltdown One Sheet Wonders group together. I am going to um, walk you through the exercises that we are going to do and some of the fitness. Um, please, please be sure you are taking care of your body and doing the right proper um, fitness uh, safety precautions. There are some things, you know, you got to make sure your knees are okay on the squats. You don't want to have your knees go over your toes. Uh, you also, your lower back when we do some of the crunches. So I'm going to, in word underneath the comments in this video, but really try to, to make sure you're doing that. I don't want anyone to get hurt while doing these videos. Okay, so our first exercise is one of my least favorites. And yes, I made this calendar and it's one of my least favorites. They are called up-downs. Okay, we're going to start in the plank position. If you need to modify, I will show you how to modify, but we're going to start in the high plank position. Okay, they're called up-downs. We're going to do three, and we're going to do three on the right, and then we're going to lead with three on the left, okay? So you actually start in a plank, so here's, we're up, and then we're going to go down. You ready? So it goes right, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, and then you lead with the left. So then you're going to go down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. Now I will tell you this. Uh, I did this in my very first free challenge group last June. I laughed and said there was no way I was going to be able to do any of those on my toes. And I couldn't. So if you need to do them on your knees, just, if you want to need both knees down, put both knees down. So as you can see, both my knees are down. Can you get them my knees, Sarah? Yeah? <laughs> Sorry, I'm so fed. Are my knees in it? Yes. I can, I can go sideways too. How's this? Like your whole body's in it. Oh, fantastic. It's fine. Okay? So just go to your knees, and then you can do the same thing. So you can go down, down, up, up. And I actually, ha, I do recommend putting a, save your elbows some carpet burn. So go, knees, down, down, up, up, up. Or if you want, if you can go halfway, you can just put one knee down, and it would be opposite knee that you're going down. So we have our left knee down, we'll, we'll lead with our right. Down, down, up, up. Okay? So that's that one. Uh, next, we're going to do leg lifts. You can either get a towel down, I'm going to get my yoga mat. Um, so we're going to do leg lifts. It's pretty simple and straightforward, but with this, oh my shoes have died. With this, you do need to make sure your back is in the mat. Make sure I get more of an angle to you, sir. <clears throat> so we're starting out at 20 of these. So again, you, your back has a no, has like a lower curve to it, so you want to make sure this is pushing in and kind of your hips are up. So you're going to put your legs up, make sure your, your spine is neutral, arms down. One, that's it. Two, again, make sure this is pressing into, into the the bottom, you don't want to arch your back at all. Two, three, if this is too hard, you can do a tabletop and go down and just do a toe tap. Okay, but again, make sure this is pushed down and this is targeting right in here. So we're starting at 20 on those. Then we're gonna do bicycles. So again, back on our back, making sure our lower back is in. Your hands are by your uh, ears. Make sure they're not uh, crunching into your neck. So wide, wide stance, and you're just gonna do a bicycle. So knee, knee, left knee out. So that's one, two, three. And we'll do 20 of those the first day. Um, oh, fun, plank, we're still on the ground. Okay, we're gonna try, um, we're gonna start out with a 30 second plank. If you can go longer, fantastic. If you can go on your toes, Fantastic. You have to go on your knees. Fantastic. Um, again, when I first started, I was not on my toes. I was on my knees. But you try a little bit every day, and you go. So here is what it looks like um, at a forearm plank. I would recommend a forearm plank, but if you have to do a high plank, because it's your, easier on your back, you can totally do that. So forearm plank, you really need to keep everything tight. You should be squeezing like in your butt and all the way down to your um, through the back of your legs. And this really is a total body exercise. So arms down. You don't want to, you know, hunch your shoulders. You don't want to pray. I try to tend to... Hello, Harry. 
I try to put my arms, you know, down so they're not, so just straight out. You want this to be flat as a plank. Look, a flat plank board. So get a phone and um, try to uh, time it off. They've all got timers on it. So this is what it would be like, a forearm plank. If you need to do one knee, do one knee. If you need to do two, do two. And if it's too hard for your back and you want to do forearm, this actually is easier for your back. So you can do a forearm plank straight up. Your arms should be underneath your shoulders. This should be a little more of a forearm plank. Okay? Um, what's next? So 30 seconds of plank on the first day. Uh, split squats. Oh, we're going on to legs. Oh, we're going to do squats and split squats. So now I'm, you might need to stand. So uh, we're doing a plain basic split squat, or a squat, excuse me. Um, when you do the squat, you have to make sure your knees do not go over your feet. So none of this, none of this. So whereas, you see how like my weight is actually on my toes? You actually want your weight on your heels. <laughs> you actually want your weight on your heels. Oh, it's okay. Okay, so the weight, you actually should be able to lift your toes up when you go down. Because your knees should not go over the top of your toes. So we're going to just do 20 ba plain basic squats. So, you know, you go down. One. Two. And when you come up, squeeze your butt because that's where the, the magic will happen. Two. Three. And then we're doing 20. Okay. Um, if you want to take that up a notch, you can always do it with weights. So you have, these are tens, I've got some eights or whatever. You can easily do the same thing, but with weights. So again, make sure your knees do not go over your toes and you're going to squat, whoops, squat, squeeze, down, squeeze. See, I think I felt better just having weights in my hand. Okay. And do 20. Okay, later on this week I'll tell you my squat story. Last um, squat we're gonna do, these are hard, and I mean hard. You do need a piece of equipment, which is, could be a chair, it could be a coffee table, could be an ottoman, okay? So, preferably something, these are really hard, but they work because they're really good. They're called Bulgarian split squats, and Sarah did them and she knows they're hard. You need to have, um, you're putting your, Balance is key here. Oh, you want to go that way? Mm -hmm. That probably makes more sense. So you need to put your one leg up on your chair or your coffee table or your ottoman. And you need to be able to make sure that when you go down, again, your knee is not going over your toe. So we're going to do three on this leg and then three on the other leg. So you're just going to go down. One, two, three. And then we switch. Get settled back up. Get your balance. Make sure you have a wide enough leg left stance. Then go down again. Three. Two. Woo! Look at that balance. Ready? Three. Again, you want to take it up. Grab your weights. And you can do them with some weights. Okay. One. And again, your, your, your weight, anything should be going through your heel, not your toe. So you're pushing through your toe, because that way it gets your butt muscle right there. Okay? This is the last one. Two, three. Okay. Now, I don't know what I hate more, up downs or burpees, but I put them in. Because if I hate them, that must mean they work, right? So, for those of you who don't know what a burpee is, we can uh, modify them too. We are going to stand up straight, go down into a plank, then pop up, and then jump up. And that's one. And I think day one we have to do five. What? Do you make over there? The light is blinding. Okay. So this is a uh, burpee. So I'm going down the ground. Can you be able to get me? Okay, you ready? Mm -hmm. So we go down, pop out, jump. Read on it. Yes. <laughs> pop out, jump. That's two. Jump up. That's three. Um, you need to modify. If you can't do the popping up. Whew, see if I can get my heart rate up. Um, you can go down and you can just step it out. Okay? Step it in. 
you can either lift it up, you can lift up your, you don't have, if you don't want to jump, you can even just lift up your, um, your toes, on your toes, okay, so you go down, this is it, back in, up, that's it, okay, that's our total body meltdown, please if you have any questions, put them in the comments below, and I hope you have, we have a great week, bye.